Hello, everybody, and welcome to the third ever Aftermath special of Total Paper Island Winners at War. Woo! Yeah, I can't believe we're able to do three specials now. This is great. Yes, and of course, we can't thank them enough, but here are our lovely audience and some of the other alumni contestants, of course. Leafy, Oshawott, Min Min, Doge, The Man, Iron Man, Trico, uh, what's the name again? Uh, it's Dejo. Yeah, right, uh, the Team Slayer Kid and Kareem. Yes, and of course, unfortunately, we couldn't get Ace and Sean to join us again. As a matter of fact, nobody's really been able to contact them lately for some odd reason. But, uh, it is what it is, I guess. Yeah, don't worry, babe, we just gotta give them their space and all. Anyways, in this Aftermath special, we will be interviewing with the five previous eliminated contestants. Speaking of that, I think it's time we bring out our first guest. The first one out of the five, aka the one who was the first contestant out from the merge. Here we have Tony, Tony Chopper. Uh, hi everybody. Uh, I guess it's uh, great to be here. <laughs> hey Chopper, how are things with you? Oh, you know, not too bad, I guess. I mean, I'm so happy that Usopp is still in the game and I'm rooting for him, man. I hope Usopp can take the dub. Yeah, so, um, here's your first question. How's it feel being eliminated? After all, you did kind of sacrifice yourself to keep Usopp in the game. Well, you know, when it comes down to me and Us Usopp leaving, of course I would want Usopp to stay and not me, because Usopp can do much better and much more than what I could have ever done in this series by myself. So yeah, I'm happy that Usopp is still in the game, and I am not mad, and I don't regret on my decision. I see. Alright, second question. If there's anything you'd say to the final five, what would that be? Well, I mean, you guys should be proud of yourselves that you're still in the game, and one of you is almost there to becoming another champion or a two-time champion i should say so um man just keep it up and the game is almost over you guys can do it especially you Usap. all right well i think that's all we have time for for you so um thanks for stopping by oh wait but before you go we've got one question from one of our peanut gallery members cream the rabbit oh that's my call hi chopper oh hey cream so my question is this if my chow is ever in trouble and needs some medical assistance, would I be able to call you to help since you're a doctor and all? Hmm, well, uh, sure, I guess, yeah. Great, thank you, that is all. Wait, uh, okay then, well, thanks for stopping by, Chopper. Thank you, and thank you all. <laughs> well, I guess I'll go join them. Now, our next guest is the one that took ninth place in this game, aka the winner from what the host considers to be the second worst season, aka the meme season. Here we have Tony the Tiger. Hello, everybody, and what is up? <laughs> it is me, Tony the Tiger, yeah. Welcome, Tony. How are you feeling? Well, guys, I am feeling great. Really? Even with your elimination? I mean, you are technically close to making it to the top five, but um, how does it feel about that? Well, I mean, yeah, I was pretty close. I did make it to the final nine and all, but hey, that is more than enough for me. I mean, I'm not, like, up there with the best winners, so it was kind of hard or... I mean, it's kind of surprising to see myself make it this far in any ways. Like, with Iron Man, the GOATS Iron Man, and Oshawa and Trico getting eliminated early, and then me still in the game with them going, so that's kind of that's kind of hard to believe, but hey, I'm happy. If you had anything to say to the remaining contestants, what would that be? Oh, to so the final five of you. Yeah, and three of you are Bloxians. Hmm, how surprising. Well, I just want to say, don't give up hope. You guys are almost there. One of you, or two of you, will be in the finale. So, um, just don't give up hope and keep trying your best, because you're almost there. You're almost to the point where you can possibly become a two-time champion. So, best of luck to you all. Yeah, this is what I would say. All right. Well, now we have a question from none other than Iron Man. So, uh, yeah. All righty then. Oh, sorry. Hey, Tony the Tiger. Oh, yeah. And to the audience, everyone that's watching right there, remember, I love you all 3,000. Anyways, um, so, yeah, my question is this. Why would you team up with Jesse HOH? I mean, like, it's not any day where you'd see, or it's not every day where you would see a contestant that's not a Robloxian work with a Robloxian. Well, yeah, but then again, you can see Deku and Usopp and who are working with Hero. So, yeah. True, but my question is to you, not them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Well, the thing is, I was pretty much on the outs on my team. I was in the bottom, and, well, both me and Jesse were in the bottom, but it was nice to work with someone instead of being by myself, you know? So, why not? Oh, I see. Well, um, thanks for answering my question. Yeet. 
And that's all we have time for you, Tony, so thank you for stopping by. No, no, thank you. <laughs> and remember, everybody, you're all great. All right, now our next guest was the eighth winner out. Well, not the eighth winner, but the winner that got eighth place in this game. And something changed with him, obviously. Anyways, it is none other than Mega Man, so um, yeah, Mega Man, come on down. Oh, uh, can someone please move me? Thank you. Actually, a bit closer. A little more. All right, thank you. A little more. All right, thank you. So, how are you feeling, Mega Man? Not good. Not good at all. <laughs> yeah, I can see why. So, um, Mega Man, uh, how do you feel about your placement being eliminated because of, uh, well, what just happened to you? To be honest, Jiro, it doesn't feel great. I mean, I actually feel cheated out of my win because Akari basically cheated to make himself safe and not me. <sighs> and I was close too. If only he didn't do that spell on me. And he doesn't have the nerve to chase me back. Like, what's up with that? Well, I don't know about that, but we do have a question from one of our peanut gallery members. Actually, wait a minute. Do we? Do any of you guys have a question on Mega Man? No? Wow. Wow, because no one has a question for you. <laughs> well, with that being said, is there anything you would say to the remaining contestants in the game? Why, yes. Camera person, can you put the camera closer to my face? Or cameraman, I'd say. So, you guys are lucky. Because, I mean, yeah, sure, I, I sound like a jerk now, but... Honestly, I really wish that I wasn't the final five. Because I would have been the final five. I mean, well, maybe. But, look, I mean, especially you, Akari. Akari, if you're watching this, you're not going to win. You keep saying that you are, but I doubt that. I bet the others doubt it too, because they aren't that dumb as they seem. So, yeah, uh, that's all I got to say. Uh, all right then. Well, uh, cameraman, you can just take him over there. Now, our next person to interview is the contestant that got 7th place in this game and is the second Demon Slayer winner, none other than Shinobu. So, Shinobu, come on down. Hi, everybody. Hey, Shinobu. So, how does it feel, or how are you feeling? Well, honestly, I'm feeling okay. I mean, I'm not mad or sad or anything. I did really good this season. So, so yeah, I guess that's all I really have to say about how I'm feeling. All right, but how do you feel about your placement? Like I said, I'm not mad or sad because I did really good. Seventh place is not bad at all, especially when you're with all the other winners. I see, I see. Well, if there's anything you'd like to say to the remaining contestants, what would that be? Well, even though they're all guys, I mean, I just want to say best of luck to you all, I guess. And, um, well, one of you will win and the others won't. So that's pretty much it. Huh, wow. All right. Well, we do have a question from one of our peanut gallery members, none other than Tanjiro. Hmm, I wonder why. All right, it's my cue. Hey, Shinobu. Long, long time no see. Oh, hey, Tanjiro. So, what's up? Oh, this may sound like a good question, but why did you choose me to be eliminated on the episode I got eliminated in? Well, you know, Tanjiro, you are a pretty big threat, after all. I mean, you are an anime character, of course, so that explains it. And you're the main character in the own series, so, um, yeah. But, honestly, I didn't really want to eliminate you. I really wanted to work together and all, but... Uh, it just it just has to be what it has to be, I guess. I mean, I, I was really planning on trying to win this season and all, but... Yeah, that, I guess that's not how I can explain it... That makes no sense, but yeah. Uh, uh, okay, uh, thank you for answering my questions, I guess. And that's all we have time for you, Shinobu, so, um, thanks for joining us. Oh, yeah. Now, last but not least, we have our most recent eliminated contestant. Yep, the Season 16 champion, Cassidy. Come on down. Hey, everybody. How's it going? So, Cassidy, how are things? Oh, well, things are going fine, I guess. I'm pretty pumped that I got eliminated all, but it is what it is, I guess. Yeah, and about that, how does it really feel about you being eliminated? I mean, you were so close to being in the top five. Yeah, looking back at it, I was really close. Oh man, if only I stay in the game much longer. But I was in the out after Shinobu got eliminated. So, you know, it wouldn't be that hard to think that I'll be the next one become the next boot. I see. Well, if there was anything you say to the remaining contestants, what would that be? Well, honestly, all five of you are doing pretty good. Akari's just playing the game really good, though. So, I wouldn't be surprised he makes it to the finale and all. But with that being said, uh, best of luck? Alright, 
And we do have a question from Trico, so um, yeah. All right, it's time for me to go. Hey, Cassidy, I just wanna say, you're looking pretty fine. Should we go on a date after this? Uh, no thank you. Oh, okay then. Uh, what just happened? Well, I guess it's all the time we have, so uh, thank you for joining us, Cassidy. Oh, please, the pleasure is mine. And with that, we have interviewed all of the guests for tonight's Aftermath. And the show is about to come to an end. That is right. We are down to our final five. Would it be Hero, the winner from Champion Survival Clash? Deku, the winner from Heroes vs. Villains. Akari, the winner from Pakatea Island. Jesse HOH, the winner from World Tour. Or Usopp, the winner from Redonkless Race. Or one of them, at least. All of these questions will hopefully be answered in the next few episodes of Total Paper Island. But with that being said, thank you all so much for tuning in to this special of Total Paper Island Aftermath. Thanks for watching.